Phew, it's finally lunchtime. I'm exhausted. I wish Inazuka were here right now. Did you need me for something? Inazuka? What are you doing here? Explain yourself! Well, so to explain, I'm here on business. What business? The local sports festival is going to be held on the college's campus this year. So I came to turn in the application. But why would you have to do that? Uh, because it's a vital community bonding opportunity, of course. And by the way, your lunch looks delicious. Did you make it yourself? S so what if I did? What's it to you? You seem like a pretty good cook, is all. You'll make someone a good wife someday. Sh shut up! What's the matter with you? Why'd you shove that fried chicken in my mouth? How was it, huh? I asked you how was it? How was what? N nothing never mind. Uh, okay. But hey, that fried chicken was pretty good. How about you make some extra for me next time? I'm not your maid, Inazuka. Make it yourself. Haha, <laughs> yeah, that's what I figured. Well, enjoy your lunch. Thanks for the chicken. You're welcome. Now leave me alone. I'm Amane. I'm a 21-year-old college student. That guy just now was Inazuka. Our families don't get along well. Officially, Inazuka and I are enemies, but... Yes! He said my fried chicken was delicious! He liked it! I'm gonna make him another batch as soon as possible. But how am I gonna get it to him? Hmm, well, that's a problem for another day. You see, the truth is, I'm deeply in love with Inazuka. I'm being very careful to not let anyone know, other than a few select people. Oh jeez, look at the time! My next class is gonna start. I'd better finish my lunch quick. Wait a minute, Inazuka and I just ate lunch together! That means we had our first date! Oof! <laughs> Looks like my waiting paid off. This is my chance. I gotta move fast. Yes, I got it. No, watch. Family heirloom. Ha! <laughs> She's talking in her sleep. I better scram before she wakes up. Mm. <sighs> what? What am I doing here? Oh, that's right. I passed out from excitement again. Oh no, I'll never make it on time. But who cares? I still had a date with Inazuka. After that, I went home. Dad, I'm home. Yeah! How about I make you your favorite pasta for dinner? Tiki? Ayane, you seem giddy. What? Nah, I'm feeling totally normal. No, I've seen you're normal. This isn't normal. You're literally dancing with your hands in the air right now. Well, actually, I saw Inazuka and... What? Inazuka? I, uh, I mean, um, nothing. Nothing at all. I didn't see anyone, especially not Inazuka. What's with you today? Nothing, Dad. Nothing's with me at all, especially not Inazuka. If you say so. Oh, by the way... What? What happened to your watch? My watch? It's right there. Wait, what? No! Did you lose it somewhere? No, that's impossible. I would never leave it behind. I never even take it off. It's the last thing Mom gave me before she died. Not to mention, it's a family heirloom. Do you have any idea where it might be? Oh, no. What is it? I, uh, passed out for a little while today. You passed out? Yeah, when Inazuka... I mean, not Inazuka. Inazuka, that scoundrel. He's responsible for you using your watch, isn't he? N no no, Dad, that's... I knew it was him. He's gonna pay for this. What should I do? I can't tell Dad the truth. Inazuka, I'm sorry. For the time being, I made a lost item report with the police. I'll contact you as soon as I find out. Thanks, Satoru. I sure hope he can find it. The thief may have sold it by now. Girl, where is it? Heiji, any luck? Nah, I can't find it anywhere. Who could have taken it? Inazuka? Oh, Mane, it's you. What are you doing here? Your dad just came by and weeped me out big time, saying something about me making you lose your family heirloom. Oh. So I'm looking for it. I have no idea how it's my fault, but I guess I gotta take responsibility. Well, no, that's... I... I don't want your filthy hands touching my things, so stop looking for it this instant! Sorry, no can do! You can't? Why not? 
You this thing is super important to you, right? It doesn't matter if it's my fault or not. I want to help you find it. You don't need to do that. I know I don't need to, Amane. I said I want to. Get away from me. Good idea. I'll go look over there. Lucky you, huh, Amane? What, what do you mean, Lucky? I told him to stop. This is Heiji. He was a classmate in high school. He works at the same company as Inazuka, and he's one of the few people who know about my feelings for Inazuka. You want to tell the truth now? I'm absolutely elated! I thought I was going to pass out again. Ha <laughs> ha! I bet someone took it while you were passed out before. You're probably right. Man, I'm sorry Inazuka got dragged into this, but I'm grateful to you for helping Heiji. Hey, I'm just helping out two of my best friends. Okay, I'm going to go over there and look with Inazuka. I sure do have some great friends. I have to find that watch, no matter what. The next day... Ugh, where could it be? Hey! Inazuka, you're here! Uh, I mean, Inazuka, why are you here? Do you know this person? Hmm? Wait, this is Aki! We're in the same class. What does she have to do with this? I asked around the campus, and I heard a few people say they saw her going up to you while you were passed out yesterday. Aki did? Now that you mention it... You think of something? Aki was really interested in that watch a while ago. Yeah? She asked me how much it cost, and I told her that it was a gift from my mom. So I don't know how much it was, and then she got her phone right out to look it up. Really? That's kind of suspicious. You can say that again. I need more evidence before I can say anything for sure, though. I'm gonna look into her for a bit. Okay, go ahead. That afternoon. And, like, Takia is so funny, right? He's, like, really hot, too. Isn't he a dream? I'm so totally in love. Huh? Hello, Aki. What do you want, Amane? I'll get right to the point. Do you know where my watch is? Watch? What watch? You mean the one you were wearing before? Yeah, that's the one. How am I supposed to know? What makes you think I know where it is? Oh no, don't tell me you lost it. It was super expensive. It went missing when I passed out the other day. Some people have said they saw you approach me while I was out. Are you saying you think I stole your watch? How ridiculous. Why would I steal a $300,000 watch? How do you know how much it cost? I looked it up the other day, remember? Hey, I'm trying to eat lunch here. Do you mind? Sorry to disturb you, Aki. She's getting more suspicious by the minute. I heard rumors that Aki had plastic surgery recently. And now that I've seen her up close, I can tell the rumors are true. Her face is totally different. Maybe. Did you figure anything out? <gasps> Inazuka! Er, I mean Inazuka! Stop sneaking on me like that! Sorry I scared you. So, any leads? I'm pretty sure she did it, but I still need evidence. So, she didn't confess, huh? What do you mean? Heiji called me while you were talking to her just now. What did he say? That night. It was a pretty close call, but I think I managed to pay off my debt. That's good to hear. I had my eyes on this watch ever since I figured out how much it was worth. 300 grand! Unreal! I was gonna sell this and use the money to pay for plastic surgery, but I never could get a good opportunity to take it, so I took out a loan and got the surgery anyway. Is that so? Oh, that's right. Thanks for doing that thing to cut down my loan. What was it? Refinancing or something? You're the best! I had no idea loan sharks even do that sort of thing. Yeah, I have good connections. We're here. You're on your own inside. Thanks, Inazuka. You're the kindest loan shark ever. I'm on such a roll in life. Ever since I got plastic surgery, I had boys lining up to talk to me. This is the best. An ugly girl like her doesn't deserve an expensive watch like this. So screw her. It's mine now. Good evening. I came to pay off my loan. This watch is worth $300,000. So if I give you this, we're even. Well, thank you for returning it to me. Huh? So, this is it. The girl who stole our family heirloom. What are we gonna do about this? <laughs> this chick is toast! No one steals from the family! An heirloom? What do you mean? I got this from a classmate at college. 
Was this girl by chance named Amine? Uh, yeah, but how? Take a good look, Aki. What? Amine? Is that you? In the flesh. N no way, that can't be. Amine is way uglier than you. Do you recognize me now? Oh my god, Amine, it is you! But, but what are you doing here? What else? This is our clan's headquarters. Your clan? Yes, the Yamanaba clan. The head of the Yamanba clan is my father. This, this is a joke, right? I'm afraid not, Aki. She is my daughter. Hold, hold on. Uh, so I just refinanced from the Uwasa clan to the Yamanba clan. And right now, I'm trying to use a Yamanba family heirloom to pay off my debt to the Yamanba clan? That about sums it up. I'm in very big trouble, aren't I? Right again. Wait, this can't be! Amine, you, you never told me that your dad was the head of the Yamanba clan. Seriously? What kind of idiot would go around saying their dad's a Yakuza boss? I keep a low profile precisely so I won't get found out. Oh yeah, that does make sense. So, um, I'll uh, give this watch back to you. So, we're even now, right? Right? I'll just be going now. Yeah! <laughs> this chick thinks she's getting the way squad free! Think about it, miss. You stole our family heirloom. We do not take that lightly. Also, there's still the issue of your debt to us. Well, I'm returning the watch, so can't we call that even? Of course not, you goddamn airhead! Wah! For stealing my watch, a penalty of $300,000 will be added to your account. N no! $300,000?! Listen, girl. Your petty thievery almost led to an all-out war between us and the Yawasa clan. Actually, that's partially my fault. $300,000 is far smaller a penalty than you deserve. Now then, how are we going to squeeze $600,000 out of this girl, boys? I have a few ideas. Yeah, <laughs> yeah! Wait, please, Amine, we're friends, aren't we? Would you really do this to a friend? I don't need any friends who would steal from me. Mitsuru, Sakuya, do your thing. Yehuda, you're done for. No! I'm sorry, I'm sorry! Please forgive me, I'll do anything! It's far too late for apologies, miss. You failed the test. You missed your last chance. What test? All you had to do was admit what you did and apologize when Lady Yamane confronted you in the cafeteria. Oh God, please help me! After that, Aki was put to work on the night shift while she was allowed to continue to attend school. She's burning the candle both ends and it shows, but considering what we've done to people who have wronged us before, she should really be grateful this is all we're doing to her. But I'm just happy to have this watch back. Oh, where is she? How long is Amane gonna keep me waiting like this? Does she know what time it is? Man, I'm hungry. Sorry to keep you waiting, Inazuka. Finally! So, why did you call me out here? You already got your watch back. What else could you need from me? Nothing, actually. What? Actually, I came to give this to you. What is that? Open it. I'm hesitant, but okay, I guess. Whoa, fried chicken! There's gotta be ten pounds of it! Oh, why are you giving this to me? Is it because I told you I liked your cooking the other day? Well, uh, no, I just made a little bit too much is all. Really? If you don't want it, just say so. No, I'll take it. Man, this is great! You really are an incredible cook. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. Er, uh, I mean, you got that right. Oh, why are you shouting at me? Hmm, there's just not enough emotion there. Yeah. I wish I could have been a bit more expressive. What are you doing here, Sadaro? Oh, you know, I was just passing by and thought I'd say hello. If you want to hang out, just say so. But since you're here, I have an idea. Yeah, what's your idea? I guess I'll have one more. Just shut up and eat already. <laughs> he likes it. He really likes my cooking. I must be dreaming. The only thing that could make this better is if Inazuka asked me to feed him. But I could never ask him to let me do that. Hey, you, Inazuka! Huh? 
What do you want, Sadaro? Don't play Dom. You're under arrest. Under arrest? Why would I be under arrest? I haven't committed any crimes. That's right, Sataru. Don't get in my way. Sorry, but you're not going to talk your way out of this one. Then tell me what I'm being arrested for. Um, uh... A licensed public consumption of fried foods in excess of five pounds. You're looking at three years behind bars. What? There's no way that's actually a crime. It, it's not. Like, I just made up a criminal offence or anything. It, hands behind your back. Come on! Is this for real handcuffs? Aw, and we were finally having a nice moment. Just the two of us. Why does Dork have to break up our fun? Come on, Sadaro, give me a break. Take off these cuffs. No can do. You're under arrest. Isn't that right, Eiji? Eiji? What does Eiji have to do with this? <laughs> I had a feeling you were behind this, Eiji. I'll lock my handcuffs. Not a chance. Why not? In Azuka, look at the fried chicken. It's getting colder and colder by the second. Isn't that a shame? Amane's fresh, piping hot fried chicken approaching room temperature. If that's your concern, then take these handcuffs off me right now. Well, I guess. Uh, uh, uh oh. I think I lost the key. You what? Sadaro, you moron! I guess there's only one option in Azuka. Amane's gonna have to feed you herself. Yep, it's the only way. What are you talking about? In Azuka, your chicken's getting cold! Amani must have worked so hard to make this much fried chicken for you. I bet she wants you to eat it while it's still fresh. For Amane. Uh, he's right, Amane. I know you may not like it, but go on and feed me. Get on with it! The chicken's getting cold! Okay, your job's all done, Sadaro. Indeed it is. Sataru, Heiji, thank you so much. Why are you thanking them? None of your concern. Eat this! Mmm, delicious. But I'm still mad at them. Ten minutes later. Thanks for the chicken, Amane. That was the best chicken I've ever eaten in my life. Inazuka. Hey, um, this is completely hypothetical, but do you really think I'd make a good wife? Huh? Just answer the question. Oh no, I actually said it. You're a great cook. You're beautiful. You're kind. I bet any man will be thrilled to have you as a wife. He, he, he called me beautiful. Now we gotta unlock these cuffs. Wait, what? I'm on. I don't pass out now. Well, I guess I'll let her rest for a minute. Inazuka, thank you. I love you. <sighs> uh -huh. When I woke up, my head was on Inazuka's lap. This is the best day of my life! I got my watch back. I spent the afternoon with Inazuka. Could my life be any better? I'm gonna have to work hard to top this.